Iya. Hot chocolate Cinderella, trap off a track trailer, blue paper stuck together. Bad bitch gon' fuck my bills. I lost him down to 187 pounds so far. How many calories are you eating a day right now? Um. My screen saver, I love the screen saver. It's a lot of eyes. Booty. <laughs> 2,550. So 170 grams of protein, 250 grams of carbs, and 230 grams of uh, protein every day. With the exception of one day, I may, I, I may eat outside of this. I had like teriyaki one time. Actually, I had teriyaki both times since being on prep. I've eaten outside of it. Yeah. And I've been sick twice already. It has nothing to do with prep, but it just is. My immune system's a little compromised, as you can tell on my voice. I can tell. Nothing a little pre-workout won't fix. That's right. Dry. Should, <laughs> I just, should I just put it on the table? Do a line? It up? Woo! Good. It's going to be rough. I won't do that. Dry scooping's harsh enough. Dry scooping some pre-workout over here. So pre That's Kenny. He's the owner of a... Uh, <laughs> say hello there. What's going on, guys? How you guys doing, man? He's the owner of. Look, he's dry scooping it too. Just oh shit! Shit, we could have just shops together. <laughs> <laughs> That's a much bigger scoop than mine is, though. <laughs> so first is just like you would in a club, and then my little chaser. That's oh what I sip on. God. Sip on some Celsius. <laughs> so I go off of what I feel like uh, emotionally. For example, if I go through a breakup, I'm probably not gonna be in the best mental state. So my workouts aren't gonna be the best. That's okay, I'm gonna do something. Something's better than nothing. Yeah. Um, health, like if I'm sick under the weather, I may not train depending on how sick I am. Mentally, like if I have a lot of things on my mind, my workouts may suffer, but I'm always gonna do something. Something is better than absolutely nothing, unless of course I get injured, then I probably should have kept my bitch out outside of the gym. But start with some lap pull downs. Remember, I ain't got no rhyme or reason for starting with a lap pull down. I don't care. I, I'll start with some pull ups or some seated rows or some machines. I don't, there, there's no, I wanna do a lap pull down first because this is gonna hit my muscle the best. That's just not how it works for me. I'm sure some people will claim that lap pull down is by far the best lap uh, exercise. I don't think anything is the best one. I do try to go all the way up with my shoulder, um, and then the, the, the more wider my lats get, I may not be able to have like complete full range of motion because my muscles are swell up full of blood. Some days I'll just stay at two. Some days I'll do a drop set. Other days I won't. Depends how I feel that day. Uh, what I mean by how I feel, like my joints. My joints may be bothering me. Um, I didn't sleep good. I got shit on my mind. I'm still not a calorie deficit. It'll get harder. Um, late September. Early October. This is never gonna happen, I'm sorry. And I think that's hard for a lot of people here. You mean my arms can't get any bigger? They can. You have a potential, and then you take some enhancements that can enhance your potential, but then that's it. 
you, you can't take anything aside from that. Yeah. And sometimes you have hyperplasia. Like hypertrophy is different, cell volumization. And hyperplasia is cell duplication. And if you take certain enhancements, it can possibly have that effect. Possibly. And that's that's a good, what is hyperplasia? That's where your muscle cells actually split and cause more cells. Oh, to grow? Yeah, so instead of having 1,000 cells, hypothetically, now you got 2,000. So your potential is greater, but that doesn't happen all the time. That's the genetic factor? Yep. When I do a seated row, I like to let my um, my back, see how my back is rounding? Yeah. Intentionally, and then when I pull back, I like to contract. So it gives the illusion that I'm rocking back and forth, but I'm actually doing it to get more of a pull in my lats, because your lats do actually lengthen and shorten. So it's intentional, not unintentional. I try not to like go all the way back either. Um, but I've seen if it works for you, then do it. Yeah, you're leaning forward even when you go back all the way. I just feel like I get a better uh, lengthen and contraction. So when I'm on stage and I do certain movements, I remember doing a seated row. That's all. So good for posing for me. For, for non-athletes or somebody who's trying to get a bigger back, just do what works for you. <clears throat> two arms, one arm. Um, I don't do any fancy tricks with this movement. I'm not gonna slide all the way back and lean forward. That's what a lap pull down's for. I don't have any fancy exercises. I stick to what works and that's it. It's basic movements, but they're effective for me anyway. And for most of my clients, they're effective. Yep. Two fifty for one. Get it, Joe. One and a half. I also don't train biceps with um back. I just do back. I do arms by themselves. Straight up arm day. Yeah. Until I get tendonitis. I usually get it here. And then I take arms out altogether. Yeah. Right amount of money, I don't mind that either. <laughs> I'm telling you, I got, I ain't got no sugar mama or daddy. I'm taking applications so for the amount of. So someone can give you a pearl necklace for about what? Five G's. Five G's. So you bet like seven. That's uh, that's seven figures. <laughs> ain't no motherfucking cheap hoe. <laughs> <What the fuck? laughs> Six figures, I'm already doing that alone. I don't need your help for that. Eat a bag of dicks. <laughs> Seven figures. That's different. It's a little different. I'm already a thousandaire. <laughs> it's a millionaire. You gotta come say, say hello if you're making millions. Fucking bulging out. See a flex that shit. Yeah, it looks sick. Sponsored by anybody? Other Not yet. Than, other than me. Maybe Miles. Miles sponsors this. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Miles, aka Ghost Throw. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. 
Bitch. Fire. At the Capitol. That'll be all up in there. Hell yeah. It's a big boy right there. What class are you competing in? Classic physique. Yeah. Two uh two divisions, open and masters. I'm trying to limit the amount of caffeine that I have. So normally when I compete, I have upwards of 1,500 milligrams of caffeine a day. Jesus. That's 1,500. That includes energy drinks, coffee, and pre-workout. So I'm trying to limit that. So right now, all I have is coffee, pre-workout. And an energy drink. Maybe, not all the time, maybe. All depends how I feel. So you're at what? 500 milligrams, 300 milligrams? Uh, under five. Under five. And I'm gonna do my best to try to keep it roughly around there. The whole, but the whole as you time. get closer to competing, it'll be at 1500? It has been, yeah, 1500. <laughs> Easy, that's, that's nothing. I don't recommend it, but I mean, uh, unless you competed either in bodybuilding or classic physique, and I, I'm this isn't taken away from any other competitors that competes in bikini because you still got to put in the work you you just don't have to be as lean that's it so if somebody's not as lean it doesn't tap into essential fats essential fats are stored in your brain also the fat between your joints start to go so everything becomes it's hard to walk because you know you're just you're less fatty everywhere yeah so, tight where in your arms lats shoulders uh biceps barcular dallas um lats shoulders i'm good tight mean like my muscles just feel like they're engorged full of blood yeah they're just like i'm naturally just a little puffy <laughs> where i don't actually walk around like that and other people's lats are are longer like the origin and assertion is going to be different for everybody same thing with shoulders same thing with chest so everybody's going to start off at a different capacity and then you work with that that's it pick your fucking shit up and have some respect it's easy i'm gonna go listen wait now bye so i'll bring it to the hip i can feel it better on my back only time I use my bell. says one minute 30 seconds one minute the fuck am i gonna do for a minute time money i gotta collect my pennies penny for your thoughts i got two cents I'm about to lose a bolt in October. <laughs> They're one twenty five, then one fifty.
Sometimes I get more. I'm a little tired. I don't know why I ain't ditch yet. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> I'm a little delusional. It's good to be delusional. You know, bitch. Yeah. Yeah. How much have you been foam rolling? What's that, a dildo? Yeah. Not done. <laughs> oh. I wonder what Swy's back is tight. <sighs> See it again. The lap. I ain't even 100%. That's a crazy workout. <coughs> All right. Good job, dude. Any questions? <laughs> Hot chocolate Cinderella, truck off a track trailer, blue paper stuck together, bad bitch gon' fuck my bills.